help me save my relationship. Trying to save my relationship was a very difficult thing to do. I was always worried that I was going to make one wrong move and I was gone to lose the person I loved forever when I was trying to save my relationship. Unfortunately, when I was trying to save my relationship, what always felt like the right thing to do was the wrong thing to do most of the time. Most times I should have followed the counterintuitive path. Whenever I felt like calling is when I should have stayed cool. When I felt like pouring my heart out is when I should have put a lid on it.as a warning, the techniques I used to save my relationship you may have never seen before and at first glance may look and feel wrong, but have been proven time and again to be effective in even what seems the most complicated situations. Technique Hashtag 1 The first technique I used was to agree with and accept the fact that my ex had broken up with me. This was very difficult to do, and the chances are good that you will have a bit of an internal battle before you're able to do so, but I realized it had to be done if I wanted to save my relationship. IT definitely helped to understand why I needed to accept the breakup, and how it helped me save my relationship. The main reason is because I needed to give my ex time to respect and miss me again. The chances are that they are mad or upset with you at the moment, especially if you've been nagging them about getting back together. Technique Hashtag 2 The second technique I used was to cut off all communication. You're probably about ready to close your browser right now. Hold on, because this technique really does work. It helped me to accept the breakup and it showed my ex that I was serious. Be why not communicating, I allowed my ex time to miss me and time to get over the reasons for breaking up with me. This space was good for my mental health as well, and it helped me to think clearly. It also set me up for the next technique. Technique hashtag 3, the next step was to plan an event where we could reconnect. Because of the previous step, my ex was starting to miss me. It wasn't a date, so to speak, but more of just a casual meeting so we could talk and see how each other was doing. I didn't smother or pester my ex, I just took it slow. This was a big step in helping me save my relationship.